Our topic for this video is on subtraction of integers using algebra tiles. To illustrate subtraction of integers, we will be using the unit tiles or one style of the algebra tiles. The yellow are the positive tiles and the red are the negative tiles. We have to remember that yellow tile minus red tile equal to zero. Let us recall the parts of our subtraction equation. We have here a minus b is equal to n. a is called the minuend and b is called the subtrahend and n is the difference. Subtract integers, change the operation to addition, and find the opposite of the subtrahend. Example number 1, positive 6 minus positive 2. We change the operation to addition and find the opposite of the subtrahend. The minuend 6 stays the same, change the operation to addition, and the opposite of positive 2 is negative 2. Then proceed to the rule in addition of integers. Using algebra tiles, we will represent this expression. We have six yellow tiles to represent positive six and two red tiles to represent negative two. Recall that one yellow tile minus one red tile is equal to zero. So we take out two pairs of yellow and red tiles. We're going to look at it. We have four yellow tiles left. So, 6 plus negative 2 is equal to 4. And 6 minus 2 is equal to 4. Example number 2. Negative 3 minus positive 10. We're going to use the same rule as in example number 1. The minuend stays the same, negative 3. The operation becomes addition, and the subtrahend is positive 10, and its opposite is negative 10. Using algebra tiles to represent this, we have 3 red tiles to represent negative 3, and 10 more red tiles to represent negative 10. Since all of them are Red tiles, so we'll just add them together. So we have 13 red tiles. So negative 3 plus negative 10 is equal to negative 13. Negative 3 minus positive 10 is equal to negative 13. Example number 3. Negative 6 minus negative 3. Applying the rule for subtraction of integers. The minuend stays the same, so negative 6. The operation will change to addition from subtraction, and the opposite of our subtrahend negative 3 becomes positive 3. To represent this subtraction expression, we have 6 red tiles to represent negative 6, and 3 yellow tiles to represent positive 3. Recall that Yellow tile minus red tile is equal to zero. So we take out three pairs of yellow and red tiles. We have three red tiles left, or we have negative three. Negative six plus positive three is equal to negative three. So negative six minus negative three is equal to negative 3. One last example, positive 5 minus negative 3. The minuend positive 5 stays the same. The operation will change to addition and the opposite of the subtrahend negative 3 is positive 3. To represent this, using algebra tiles, we have 5 yellow tiles and 
another three yellow tiles to represent positive three. We will just count them since they are the same yellow tiles. So there are eight yellow tiles. Where five plus positive three is equal to eight, and five minus negative three is equal to eight. Try to answer the following using the rule for subtraction of integers. I will give you a few minutes to do this. And I will show you the answer. Here are the answers to our exercise. Try to look over your answer and compare it to the answer that I have here. You got 5. Excellent. You got 4. Correct. Very good. You got 3. It's quite alright if it's less than 3. So don't be discouraged. Just practice more. You can go to Google and find subtraction of integers worksheets and try to work on it and watch again this video lesson. Thank you for watching my math class, Mathematics Made Easy. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. Thank you and see you next video.